Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we have a very special series that I'm super excited about that I have named Mask Mondays. Pretty much every Monday, you will be receiving a video from me. Yes, finally, I can kind of give you guys a little schedule. Um, but yeah, every Monday, I'm going to pretty much be trying on a mask. It's just pretty much a little chill. You know, let's talk a little bit. Let's try something. Let's relax. Grab some tea grab some chips grab some water just you know a little cute moment where you and i can hang out so if you guys have any recommendations or you're just wanting to know if a mask works or not but you don't want to spend that coin let me know in the comments down below so i can go ahead and try it for you guys um i've made a goal for myself that i want to upload at least two videos per week so hopefully crossing my fingers and i'm praying to god that everything works well but like i said every monday you will be having the video for me so with no further ado let's go ahead and get this video and series started so pretty much mask mondays is exactly what it means i'm going to be trying out masks for you guys it could be either a hair mask a face mask a lip mask a eyebrow mask is there such thing as an eyebrow mask i don't know but eye mask anything that has to do with mask you guys i'm gonna be doing this on my channel every monday so let me know in the comments down below if there's any particular masks that you guys want me to try that you're just like so unsure about so let me know and i got you so to pretty much start off this series we're gonna go ahead and start it with this gold mask that i purchased from tj mask this is from the brand global beauty care and it looks like this it's pretty much just a regular gold peel off mask um i got this at tj maxx for $3.99 I mean how inexpensive is that <laughs> much the claims to this mask are um, it's a gel based mask that reaches deep within the pores to dissolve and dislodge the buildup of impurities um, the ingredients I really really do like um, it has green tea and witch hazel cucumber and chamomile tea tree and salicylic acid and aloe vera and vitamin e and gold and vitamin c so we're gonna go ahead and pretty much put this on obviously i haven't opened her because she's brand new so let's see what the fuss is about oh i don't know it smells very chemical oh look can you guys see like it's really old i know you guys can't really tell but it kind of has a little bit of glitter let me see i'm trying to put it up close to see if you guys can kind of see and i'm going to be pretty much taking my elf mask putter on is that what it's called well i like to call it my mask spatula this is what she looks like you guys and this is legit like my favorite tool to apply any type of mask to my face it just gives me that even coat that i you know i like and this is rubbery and then on this side it's it's very soft and you can use this side to like just you know spot treat i rarely use this side i'm mostly on this side so let's go ahead and just apply it oh she thick she real thick y'all see that oh mm. okay and let's just put it on i should have put it not put it but i should have brought a mirror but i'm over here using my viewfinder so that's okay and you're supposed to leave it on for like 20 to 30 minutes and that's what we're gonna do i 
just don't like the smell of it. <coughs> I'm already coughing, you guys. Mm. Hold on, you guys. I can't do it just looking at this. I need to go get a mirror. Hold on. I'm going to keep applying it. How you guys been? I feel like I haven't really seen... Well, I've never seen you guys, but, you know, talk to you guys in a while. I don't know if I like the... Like, you guys see, like, well, if you apply it, I'm scared to apply it with my hands, but I think the hands might be the best way because this formula is not working for me. But I don't want to get my hands sticky. It does suggest you guys to shave your face first before applying this, which y'all know I like to shave my face. Did I do it before? No, <laughs> but we shall see if it does make a difference. Honestly, you guys, like, as of right now, like, formulation-wise, I don't like it. I feel like I have to use so much product just to get, like, an even layer. And even with that, it's not even giving me an even layer. Like, what is wrong with this mask? Sorry, I keep putting it right in front of you guys, but I want to make sure that, like, everything is kind of... Like, can you guys see? It's almost like breaking apart right here. As I'm trying to like layer it. And it's... I'm trying to remember like what this reminds me of. Like almost like slime, but it's... And it smells like... Like slime. I don't know, it's just weird. You see, like, oh my god, this is bad. I'm trying to add more on this side. I can't even have none right on my nose. And I could tell you guys right now that it's not this, it's not the e.l.f. spatula because I've used this so many times with plenty of masks and it does its job. It's just 
the formula of this mask is just weird. I seriously think this is like the best that we're gonna get so we're just gonna go ahead and let it sit for 20 to 30 minutes and let's see what happens but in the meantime you guys like honestly how you guys have been are you guys like excited for mask mondays or you guys are just like eh let me know in the comments down below if you prefer for me to have mask mondays you know just a time where we could chill hang out put our feet up and just relax or i can also do monday mukbangs so just let me know in the comments down below which one you prefer and like i said i got you should we just blow this and maybe it'll dry faster so i can take it off because It's almost like slime, but it's not like just any slime. There's a particular slime. If you guys just smell it. It's almost like, I'm not sure if when you guys were younger, you know the little maquinitas, the 25 cent machine, and you could get the little slime hand, and you could put it in your ring, like in your ring, and then just, you know, go like that, and it was like a hand. That's exactly what this mask smells like. Exactly. And they brought me back like, I've smelled this before. Where have I smelled it? Yeah, the little maquinita's hands. That's what it is. Ugh, I'm thirsty, child. Whew. Make sure that with this hot weather, you guys, you guys are drinking your H2O. tell you guys i'm gonna go ahead and let this mask dry so i will be back in a flash and we're back guys it has pretty much i want to say 95 percent of it has dried i'm sorry that i'm talking like this but it's kind of like hard so i can't really like you know talk <laughs> i don't want to laugh but i can't i mean i like how it looks you guys no lie like this gold face yes i'm living for it like that glow like mm, yes but i just don't like the smell and i don't like the formula of it so let's go ahead and pretty much let's start painting and see what happens i'm gonna start from right here This is going to be kind of interesting because it's really hard now. Oh. I think I'm going to zoom you guys in for this part actually just so you guys could see. And we're zoomed in so let's start peeling. Some parts are still like a little wet. Okay. Ooh, this part is still not ready.
Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys could see it in my hand. There's like little pieces there. Around my eyes, I'm getting a little, a little watery. Oh, I was like, I'm gonna get a full mask off. Let's see this. Okay. You guys see, it made me cry. But here is the mask. For the most part though, I love how I like it left my skin feeling super, super soft. Like this is legit, like really soft. I just don't like the smell. I do definitely see what they mean when they say it's best if you shave first just because you don't want your little hairs to be, you know, pulled. So if you guys like end up purchasing this mask or if you guys see it at TJ Maxx and you get it, definitely shave before you put it on. Because now I feel like my face is a little, like, not irritated but... It hurts. <laughs> so pretty much this is what my face is looking like guys with the mask off. Like I said, it does feel super, super soft. So I do like the effect that it did give my skin. I just don't like the formula and I don't like the smell. So my final thoughts on this mask from a 1 to 10. I want to give this a 7 just because like I said, it does feel super, super soft. And I mean... My face looks clean, like I feel like it did pull everything that I needed to pull out. Except around my nose, I feel like around there, I still have like my pores clogged a little bit. But for the most part, it did remove everything. Your skin is going to react to it because since you are pulling, it does hurt a little bit. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I mean you guys saw my eyes got watery and I'm a type of that I can tolerate pain. So if a mask makes me cry, it's, it's serious. But I really do, like I said, like what the results are. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and give this mask a 7. This pretty much concludes this video, you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed to my channel already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. And make sure you turn on that notification bell on so that way you are notified every time that I upload. I hope that you guys have an amazing rest of this week. And I will catch you guys on my next video.